Hello everyone, are you ready for another adventure? It's me, Wogi, and I'm back with another Jumpooty video, and I'm here with Zen. Hello. Hello, and we're here to summon- I'm here to summon for All Might and Deku, because I actually have the gems to do it, and Zen did not have the gems to do it. He's gonna wait <laughs> until he see how many more gems the celebration gives him before uh, he sees what he has to do <laughs> to get them. <laughs> so it's just gonna be me summoning today. Uh, so I hope you like the video. If you do, feel free to slam that like button and tell me how you did if you're playing the game and stuff like that. Or comment in general. I think that helps you regardless of anything, but <laughs> it's fine. Let's go into it, huh, Zen? So. Let's do it. These dudes. Nice. I want them. Let's see how this goes. I have enough for a pity. I sure as hell hope I don't have to pity because I had to pity the last time I did a video on something <laughs> related to Chibuti summoning. Ah, but I do want them. I actually think, uh, funny enough, All Might really does fit the theme of Legend, and, uh... Uh-oh, we got a five already, baby. Ooh, five from the start? Wouldn't it be funny Is this the single or the... Oh, no, it's a multi. Okay. okay. Kuwabara, giving us double piece, hoping for victory. Anime Girl, I don't remember from. Naked Pervert Man from Ninku. <laughs> Nezuko! Uh, I need, I need more Nezukos, but... I she's, love that yeah, little... she's got a good buddy skill. Yeah, I also like that little animation of her returning to the small one. I am a sucker for Nezuko because I'm one of those dudes. There's two people I feel in the world. There's one dude who goes, Nezuko is such a useless character, fuck her, how dare she exist. And then there's a dude going, ha, she do cute thing. <laughs> Yay. And I feel like I'm on that camp <laughs> where I'm like, aw, adorable. Give her the best female anime character of the year award. <laughs> yeah. I think that's probably the part where it actually loses a lot of people, is the part where she wins awards. <laughs> Let's go into it, huh? But I like her a whole bunch. In, in her I'm not games. huge on her, but I don't hate her. She's kind of just there. Yeah, I feel like that's the Oof. main... Yeah, this is bad. We got Frozen... I don't know who that where that is from, actually. That's Misa Misa, that's obvious. That's a death note. The crying guy from Lucky Man. Unlucky guy, I'm gonna assume that guy's name is. Cat's Eye Detective. I don't know. Quickly, Zed. Too late. That was Kamiya Kaoru from Rurouni Kenshin. Yeah. Votan, I know this one. Funny enough, there is now characters that you would potentially know. That's from Space Cab Space Adventure Cobra. I don't know her name, though. The Gray Man guy. And Little Anime Girl again. There's actually now, I have you here for the occasional series that you've watched that uh, you would know the name of, which is basically just Ryoni Kenshin characters, I would say. You probably actually know some of the more modern ones as well, but there's not a lot of new modern guys in Jambuti, in the grand scheme of things. And by modern, I mean like post-2019. Ooh, five star! Let's go. One five star right at the beginning. Come on! Damn you! Ouch. It's the two lover girl. She is new for me. I don't remember if that's the one from... If that's the character that the wife took in the divorce. <laughs> I don't <laughs> remember. Oh god, you're right. Yeah, if you don't know this, we talked about this in Japuti Jams, but uh, two lover is best remembered as the one where the one of the main girls was based off of his wife. And his wife cheated on him and then divorced him, and she got her character in the divorce. So if you ever wondered why that character got less emphasis when the new manga started, it's because he got divorced and she was based off his ex. Yeah, which is crazy. It's, it's fucking crazy. That is crazy. That is easily one of the craziest things I've ever heard to, hap to happen in a jump thing ever. In a manga thing ever, basing someone off of your significant other... And then they go and cheat you, and then they go and take the character into the divorce. That's insane. It's like if someone, if like a Superman writer made a female character based off of his wife or something, and then she cheated on him, and then she got the character in the divorce, you would just never see that over here. It's just not something you would see in the divorce proceduring. No, not at all. It's fucking wild. Yeah. Hey, World Sugar guy. Hey, nice. Hinamaru Sumo guy. Hey, and it's Strawberry 100% Girl. Evil laughing. Oh, that's uh, the coach from Kuroko. Oh, okay. Oh, Hochaku, as I was about to call her. Ohaka. Gravity Girl. That's her hero name. 
Eravity, yeah. Eravity. Damn it! I'm forgetting everything. She hasn't really done much, except for yell at the people in the most recent chapter, and then I potentially maybe fight someone. He's fighting Let's Toga see. right now. Yeah. I didn't want to mention it, but I forgot that you just don't care Fuck. about spoilers. It's alright. The rates in this shit are so bad. They are very bad, Kuwabara. That's why I also don't want to quickly pass forward it, because I know that if I pass forward all these characters, I'm going to just get livid. <laughs> So I have to look at them, make their little cute animations. This is how you stay calm and collected, Zen. At least that's how I do it for my Fago videos. Uh, which helps a little bit there. You know what this game needs? They need fake out. It would help. They do for need fake outs desperately. Yeah, go. Ooh, nice. Huga Great. from uh, Kuroko. There you go. You know, funny enough, you know Kuroko characters. If there were if there were slam dunk characters in here, I'd be able to tell you, but they don't have them in here. <laughs> Please add slam dunk characters for the love of God. If that force festival comes around and there's no new slam dunk things, I'm just gonna give up. I'm never gonna get my boys in here. My old style '90s basketball boys, five star. Is this the guaranteed one? Ooh, two. Let's go. Ah, damn Fight it. Though. Oh, from... Who's he Kenshin. From? Oh, okay. See, I, see, this is why you're here. You attracted the Kenshin characters. Now attract All Might and Deku. I know you're the number one fan of uh, My Hero. Yeah, My Hero Academia's number one fan. Constantly on Twitter saying, like, Peak Fiction has arrived once again. Yes! Oh, Peak oh, Fiction oh, has oh, arrived! Oh, <laughs> uh, Peak Fiction has arrived, Zen! That wasn't even the guarantee. It wasn't. Go follow uh, the Shonen and Chilled if you want to hear more glorious recommendations of My Hero Academia. Woo! Now, oh, you're close enough to the pity that, ah, oh, man. If you're going to use them, it might even be worth it to, to get the pity for the free one. No, uh, you think so? Hmm. You know, who do we have up next? Let me look at the roadmap. Because depending on who we have next, I might either do that or not. Uh, if you don't know, there was a roadmap released for the game that shows the future characters, and there's definitely some series that I want, um, that I kind of want to save and wait for, but if they're far away, then I can summon freely and kind of get them. Because I do want to use these guys. They seem pretty good, from what I read up. They are really good. I really like them. Yeah. And I don't have a, a, a strong blue attacker. I've been using, uh, the tennis boy that I got for free. <laughs> The from Prince of Tennis, the one that goes Super Which Saiyan one? Blue. Super Saiyan oh, Blue one. Oh, Ryoma. Yeah, I've been using him. So, he's been doing fine. He's not, like, saving me games, but better than nothing. Okay, almost there. This is the hard scroll down. Okay, so let's see, April, we have the My Hero events. My Ship Elementation. Oh, Golden Week is next. Shit. Buso Rankin, which I don't know anything about Goose Buso Rankin. <laughs> Who do you think could pot potentially be here for Golden Week? Who's popular enough that they would be like... I shouldn't ask you this because I know what you want to answer. Uh, <laughs> what's a popular <laughs> series enough that would be worthy of Golden Week? Oh man, I have no idea. Hmm. What could it be? What could it potentially be for Golden Week? I have no idea. So let me see if it's Golden Week in May, followed up by Reborn and the Prince of Tennis. Campaign something like June Brides. Mm -hmm. Speaking of summer, One Piece. Campaign One Piece. <laughs> oh yeah, big One Piece celebration coming in July. Look forward to it. I know you're ready for it. <laughs> Great. Followed up by August's 1010 event in Black Clover. Gintama, and then I think next in September is World Trigger, Mystery Event, Medeka Box, Mysterious Crossover, and then we're going into Anniversary at that point, I want to say. So, hmm. And also, at some point, they are releasing Stone Ocean and Magical Patissier Kasaka-chan. Yeah, I saw the announcement for Stone Ocean. It's pretty cool. Yeah. Hmm. Hmm, I think I will call it here for now. I think there's enough things with Golden Week on the way. To make me go like I need to not. Actually, Golden Week isn't until the end of the month. Okay, let's go. Never mind. You convinced me, Zen. 
Let's get these boys some more. Alright, let's see what we got here. For this one, now that we have one, we can quickly go through it if it's not anything worth talking about. Let's go! Yep, oh, trash. But also release a new Ice Shield 21 character with him as the main one, please, for the love of god. He's too cool to be left as a four star. <laughs> Next. See what we got here. Come on, five star. All right, moving forward, moving on. And this is the final one. No, that was the final one, right? So now I should have him. I think it's box. the next one. Check, but I think it's the next one is the final one. Yeah, I don't want to accidentally spend more than I have to. Okay. Yep, it's the next one. Because it should reroute you back to 500 when you just did the guarantee. Oh, really? Okay. Yeah. A thousand off, huh? Well, thankfully, I should be able to get, like, thousands more as the celebration continues on. So it shouldn't be too big of an issue. Oh, it's a five-star. How clutch would it be if you got it here? <laughs> It'd be nice. It's not guaranteed five-star at the end? No. You get it in the gift box straight away. Oh, okay. I wonder why they do it that way. Let's just quickly... Krillin! Krillin it! You! I don't know you. You have a Muso in the Taiwanese version of the game, though. Switch. Come on, right here. Nope. Dog. <laughs> it's dog. Okay. I actually use dog in some things, so it's fine. Alright, I'll take that free one, though. It's pretty good. I would say that's a successful video for me. Uh, of course, I have too many characters. <laughs> I have to remove a bunch of them. <laughs> so... I'll do that off screen. Thank you very much, everyone, for watching. Thank you, Zen. I think you were here for the luck. I, I, I can't that believe that was me. I didn't... That was all me. It was all you, 100. percent Because as soon as we started talking about your backstory with My Hero Academia, they showed up super easily. So I think that's a sign that they just can't quit you, Zen. No matter what you do to them or what you say about them. <laughs> Unfortunately for me. <laughs> But anyway, I'll see you guys in the next video. I hope you liked it. See you guys next time. Say goodbye, Zen. Goodbye, everybody. Peace out.